Hi guys, I am so tired, I am so sleepy, and guess what? I got myself on the ground, okay? Because I'm actually in my freaking garage. So, the reason why I didn't do a video, y'all, which I should have did a video, but I didn't feel like it because I'm, I'm tired, okay? So I didn't feel like doing the editing and all that good stuff or whatever, so. <clears throat> I am here, honey. So y'all, guess what I did today? I went to DG, y'all, okay? And I did the spin 30, um, get $5 off, right? I made a boo-boo, y'all. Hey, shout out with the receipts. So, what I did was, y'all, the very first one, it was cool. The second one is the one that I messed up on because I was supposed to get another $5 printed off. But, I'm going to tell y'all what I did. So, but a very, I put some of the stuff up, y'all. So, I got, like, the big game. This is the big one, y'all, for $13.50, Okay. I did, I can't take this out of place because I'm selling it tomorrow, okay? <laughs> so I did the big gang, y'all, for $13.50. We have a $3 digital that's taken off for um, the big um, 120 ounce of gain. Um, hey, Miss Barbara, so for the one that's $13.50, you have to scan it, okay? Because it's not doing for the original, y'all. It's only doing for, this is the blissful breeze y'all it scanned for this one okay um so i did that for 13.50 i did the febreze spaces i did two of these they're three dollars and you have a three dollar digital to take off of one of them okay i also did the little one i did this one it's priced at three dollars on the Hey, Julia. So y'all have to scan them because the digitals is not attaching to like the original one. So you have to scan scan them to see what um, digital is attaching to the item. So I did this one. If you're just coming on, y'all, I did the spin um, 30, get $5 and get $5 off. And you also get the $5 printed at the, the bottom of your receipt. So I was excited to get that, okay? So I did that. And I did the sheets, y'all. These are 105 sheets. These things are originally $4.50. They're on sale for $3.95. We have a $1 digital to come off for the gain, 105 gain sheets. I did that. Oh, let me show y'all a new dishwashing liquid I got. It is this one, y'all, okay? So I got two of these. I love that natural. Thank you, Miss Wilson, girl. I'm about to go wash it. I'm about to get in the shower y'all i'm about to wash this stuff out because it's some not even clean i got two of these so you have a dollar off one um when you purchase two and this is the honey berry lula people i just like the color i think it was cute and i don't have this in my stockpile y'all so i chose to pick up two of these okay and that was it, y'all. I picked up the big one for $13.50 with a three. Hey, CJ Spicy. I did the $13.50. I did the two three dollars for the um for these people right here. I did the um the gain liquid, the little bitty one, the gain sheets, and the honey sugar liquor. So my total for the first one, y'all. I would like to get to know. Hey Alexander. So for the first, y'all, my subtotal was $17, y'all. Okay. It was $17 and the taxes was $2.59. I ended up paying $19.59 for all that gain. On top of that, I received back that $5 off. Hey, Regina, I got the $5 off, y'all. So this is the receipt for the first one. This is all of the gain, y'all. So if you can see the receipt, I paid $17. I had a savings of $14, y'all. $14. And I got the $5 printed out, which means I did, hey, saving with Isha. That means, hey, Mississippi, I mean, fees in here, I didn't see her. And this is the second one, y'all, that I did. So the second one, I messed up. So my subtotal was $12 on the second one. So if you want to go do the spend 30 get five, you have to make sure that your subtotal is 
um, $15 or more because if it's not $15 or more then the $5 is not going to print out so this is what the one that I messed up on hey baby girl this is the one that I messed up on y'all so instead of me having my total of $15 my total was $12 and the $5 didn't print out on the second one okay so this is for the second one y'all is $12 and I saved a total of $19, y'all. $19. Okay? So I did the deal twice. So if you just came up in here, y'all, I did the game deal. Spend 30 get uh, $5 off. And you get a $5 printed off the end of your receipt if you do $15 or, or, or more. I'm sleepy, y'all. Okay, let me speak to everybody. Hey Alexander, hey Miss Pierre, hey Miss Barbara, hey baby girl, hey Saving with Fifi. She has a channel, y'all. Um, got baby girl, got Fifi. We got Saving with Isha. She has a channel, honey. Hey Miss Barbara, I like to acknowledge all you guys, okay? Hey Miss Regina, short with the receipts, y'all know that's my girl. She has a channel. About to switch from my phone to my laptop. Need my new, need my phone, child. So all caps and no emojis. Here I come. Love you, Sade. We got CJ Spicy in the house. Miss Wilson, Miss Julia West, and Miss Barbara. Thank you all for tuning in, y'all. I did not want to go spend the money that I spent on game, but um i did but i am actually selling it tomorrow yes Sade, i was so excited that i got the five dollar and one cent but i messed up on the second one because on the second one you beat me to it so what Sade? beat you to what girl y'all speak to Sade, honey because y'all know she plays no games hi chat i don't know what she's talking about y'all but <laughs> On my second one, y'all, it was $12 and it should have been $15. So when I got in the car, I'm thinking I had another $5 at the end of the receipt, negative grasshopper. So if you um, don't have your total to be $15, you're not going to get that $5 printed out. Beat me to saying that I have a channel. Oh, I got you, boo. I got you. If anybody um, have a YouTube channel that comes in on my lives, honey, trust me, I'm giving you a shout out, honey. So I only have three of you guys that have a channel, um, and that's Saving with Fee, Saving with Isha, and um, Shawty with the receipts, honey. So y'all, I went and did my gain. I didn't want to spend that money on, but I spent the money on gain, okay? Um, I need to go get my paper, and I need to go get my pen. Or what I'm going to do is, for the guys that has tuned in, <laughs> I did not do the giveaway on Sunday. So, I did not do the giveaway on Sunday. So, I have $20 um, to spare. So, with that being said, 5, 10, 15, 20. That's four or $5 bills that I would like to cash out. I want to cash out PayPal. Who up in here have Cash App? I prefer Cash App. I don't really care for PayPal, but I'll send it to PayPal. So, who all up in here have Cash App? Sade, you cannot play. Uh, Saving with Fee, you cannot play. <laughs> and Saving with Isha, you cannot play. If you got a channel, you cannot play this game. This is me giving $5 away to show appreciation to, um, you know, you guys that take the time out to... Um, join um my channel and my videos i don't mean it in a bad way i mean it that y'all are youtubers so by y'all being youtubers hey short mama <laughs> girl short mama i started to text you girl because i had put some bundles together girl and i was like lord i don't want to overcharge these people honey i hope i am not over overcharging these people on these bundles honey because i have to text short mama you are so not fair. She always is quite a Because you are a big YouTuber, honey. You need to send some of your subscribers over here. That's what you need to do, honey. But uh, short mama, girl. I said, Lord, I don't want to text her because I don't even know what time zone that you own, honey. Oh, you so sweet. Okay, so I need help. Oh, Lord, let me hit, click on this, y'all. Hold on. I need help because... 
Um, in my garage, first of all. Hey, T. What's up, T? So, I'm just, I have four or five dollars that I want to give away. I want to cash app you guys. It's simple. It's easy. Most of you guys already know me. Most of you guys already know about me. First come, first serve, honey. And it's very easy. Very easy. Whoever answered the question first, you need to um, either um, email me your cash app information so I can cash app you your money. Um, Nikki TV, where in the hell have you been? Girl, if you don't do a video, honey, I'm coming look for you. Y'all, Nikki, y'all know Short Mama Coupon in the house, honey. Short Mama Coupon is in the house, and if you are not on her channel, I will need you to subscribe, okay? So I got Short Mama Couponer, that's the queen of YouTube, that's my girl. We got Shorty with the Receipts, that's my girl too. We got Saving with Fee, we got Saving with Isha, and we got my girl Nikki TV in the house. I don't know where in the hell she been, but y'all going over, honey, because I love her channel. I know, Short Mama, I just asked her where in the hell she been, because I like her uh, channel, honey. I like when that music come on, honey. So, <clears throat> let me tell y'all this. My very first question is very easy and first come, first serve. Y'all YouTubers cannot play. Y'all big timers cannot play, okay? So I need help from my mods. I need y'all to help me. Um, oh, so um, you the you the penny queen, Sade with receipts. Short mama is the queen of YouTube. You know she the queen of YouTube, now. Thank you, Letty. Where you been, Letty? Let me get the first question out the way, okay? First question, you get the answer right. Send me your cash app. I send you $5. I'm sparing $20 because that's all I have to spare. So $5. There go my girl. Monica is in a house, honey. That's my girl, honey. Um, moving, working, the pandemic in my boutique. Yes, y'all. Nikki TV has a boutique, honey. She do sell very, very nice clothes. Hey, Miss Perez. First question, Monica, I need your help. Shawty, we receipts. I need your help. Um, I'm doing... Uh, Three, uh, four or five dollar giveaways because y'all know I didn't have a chance to do the giveaway on Sunday. Yeah, hey girl, bargain shopping with Tisha. I think I may be saying that wrong. She has a channel also, y'all. She's a big time a couponer. Y'all couponers cannot play this game. First question, <laughs> and it's so easy. So y'all ready to type? Oh, y'all ready to type? Okay. I hope y'all ready to type. And y'all better know this question because y'all know I cuss the answer because I cuss up. Who is my favorite football team? First, first person that get this right, honey, I'm sending you your $5. I just need your cash app. Who is my favorite football team? <laughs> Monica. <laughs> Monica got it, y'all. Monica, make sure that I am not wrong. Why short mama? You was <laughs> Nikki, you he is okay, Monica. I need you to um email me your cash app, even though you did, or Monica, you can request your five dollars because I think you have my uh cash app. It's easy questions, and it's people that actually know me. And it's people that follow me, you know. I just want to give back, y'all. Shot Mama Couponer is a big coupon, honey. Look, my fat ass, I'm starting to sweat out here in this damn garage, y'all. I'm hot as hell. My monkey sweating. My monkey need a shower, honey. I'm, I'm hot, girl. She's screaming. Thank God I ain't got no hair, baby, because, Lord, Jesus, Lord, that kitten is like, meow. Um, Let's see. <laughs> Titty sweating, honey. All of it sweating. I need a fan, honey. I need a fan. The shower, the water is going to run for me, honey. I'm hot. I got my fat ass sitting on this ground, honey, and I'm sweating, Lord. First person that went, hey, Asia. Um, y'all, and I got rose and shit. Y'all, I'm sweating. Y'all about to take this hair out, y'all. I'm hot as hell, okay? I'm hot, y'all. Ooh, child, I might need to put that back in. Hold on, wait. Oh, hell no. Oh, no, honey. I look like who did it and who done it, y'all. Y'all wrong for that shit. Y'all could have told me. Hold on, ooh, y'all. Let me get this over with because I'm hot, honey. I need a shower, honey. I feel musty and fat, honey, and disgusting, honey. Um, hold on, honey. That look okay. 
Okay, question number two. Oh, shit, y'all. I'm hot, honey. Lord, my bra gonna need to be washed, honey. Okay, so we got question number... <laughs> my baby say it's not fair that couponers can't... Oh, tell them I'm so sorry, but y'all big timers, honey. I'm so I need a damn fan. Y'all, I got a new fish. I got a new... I, I have a fish, y'all. I have a fish now, okay? I have a fish, okay? I'll show y'all my fish later. But I'm like, hey, I'm trying to get my fat ass in here and take a, a shower, y'all, because... It ain't going too well with heat, honey. I need I need Alaska weather, honey. I'm in Louisiana and it's hot as hell. Big girls don't like heat. Point blank, period. Yes, I have a new fish, Monica. My new fish name is Nelly, honey. It might start wrapping in that damn fish tank. Okay, so my second question, very easy, y'all. It's not hard at all, y'all. First come, first serve. This is my second five dollars. Um, the first person that won was Monica. Um so, girl, he over here yelling, say his mama, say his <laughs> Nikki, <laughs> blow him a kiss for me. Okay, so my second question to you guys is, how old am I? Oh, shit, check my cash. I might need to go get my other phone, huh? I'm not 40. Hey, Kanisha. I... 30, girl, really? Don't make me start feeling myself, baby girl. No, honey. Miss Barbara got it. Miss Barbara, I am 41 years old, honey. 41. Miss Barbara, I need you to send me your cash app. Miss Barbara got it. I am 41 years old, y'all. 41. 41. Girl, don't make me get... Girl, look, let me fix the... Hold on, wait, because Regina's trying to, <clears throat> don't make me model, girl. Don't make me get my fat ass. Hold on, wait. Oh, Lord. Yeah, wait, hold on, wait, wait, wait. <clears throat> I, I still look. <laughs> Y'all know I like the clown, right? <laughs> so, the second person that got the answer right, that is Miss Barbara. I am 41 years old. 41, honey. Don't make me start popping it up in here. <laughs> I'm about to see my fat ass. <laughs> Girl, don't make me hit that Louisiana, honey. All right, honey. All right, so the first person won. Who child? The first person won was Miss Monica. <clears throat> okay. Whew. I'm going to need a, a whole new bottle of body wash, honey. I thought you were going to text us the answers. Oh, shit. I only have one phone. I don't have no two phones, shorty. Don't make me get back up and start twerking it. <clears throat> yep, that's why right. Monica won $5. Miss Barbara won $5. So, um, wait, short mama told me to go check my cash app. Um... So I have two more five dollars to give away. I'm gonna have to call S. My baby's studying, y'all, and if I disturb her, she's gonna be like, "Mama." Um, I think it's in my truck, though, y'all. So the third um, question that I'm going to ask, um, what is my daughter's name? I just said it. I just said it. Do anybody know her name? I'm about to go right. Monica, <laughs> Monica beating y'all, honey. Monica was the first one. Correct me if I'm wrong. This is not hard, y'all. That's the third five dollars, honey. Who child? Oh Lord. Okay, so we got Miss Barbara. We got Monica twice. I don't know what to do for my last... Well, let me check. I have to check my phone from Sharp Mama, y'all. So, I'm probably going to have to get up and go get that other phone um, and make sure that it's on. Monica, you already... Know, Monica know all the answers, y'all. I'm telling y'all. Monica knows all the answers. I'm not going to do... What was my dog? What is my dog's name? <laughs> I 
<laughs> no, Alexander. <clears throat> I'm not doing that. Monica knows all the answers, y'all. I'm telling y'all. Monica knows all the answers. <laughs> well, how about we not going to do what is my dog's name? We're going to do what was my dog name that passed away? I'm sorry, short mama. What was my dog name that passed away? You got the middle name right. Alexander B got got it right. <laughs> his, his name was Vixen, and he even I mean he even spelled it right. His name, hey Miss Geraldine, his name was Vixen. So we have. Let me go and check my phone because I think I have another question that I can ask you guys. Um, from Short Mama. So y'all, if Short Mama sent me money through Cash App. Um, so y'all give um, Short Mama a thanks because I'm going to ask you guys another question. So I need to get up and do all this and start sending money to you guys. Okay. I have one more question for you guys and I'm going to take my fat ass a bath. Hey, Miss Chilton. Yeah, I'm so hot. My hands starting to swell. I feel like they're about to pop. Yes, y'all. Thank you, Miss Judy. Yes. Thanks, Short Mama Couponer, honey. She is amazing. She loves to give. She loves to help. Okay. Shot it with the receipts. She got it. When is my birthday? Hey, Miss Clark. Thank you, Short Mama, for everything you do. Short Mama helps me out a lot, y'all. Kanisha got it. It is July 4th. So, Kanisha, I think I've cashed out you before. Um, can you keep that cash out for your own penny purse why alexander i want to give it i want to give it away i want to give it away alexander is my king honey alexander is my king of comments honey follow keto thank you monica right after my birthday yes honey i'm a firework and i pop and i pop I'm a firework, honey. Trust me, honey. Trust me, honey. I am a firework. Right now, I'm feeling like a damn um, mudslide. I need to go take a bath, honey. Hey. Pop, 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 pop. Y'all, my breasts look some huge, don't they? I look some big on here, y'all. What do y'all want to talk about? Why I'm sitting here on this ground, honey. Okay, I need everybody that, I need everybody that um, won that $5. I need all y'all to request your $5 from me or I need you to email me your cash app, okay? I need you to email me your cash app. Is there anything that you y'all y'all want to talk about, honey? Y'all want to talk? Y'all want to talk about some strange stuff, honey? This is a good time to come on live. Look, here lots of people here. Alexander, by this time, I've been um, I probably would be out drinking by now. Um, or either on my way home. Thank you, Miss Barbara. Miss Barbara, you sent me your cash app. And um, I will be sending you your money. Um, but you know you could have text my mom the answers on your apple watch oh shit girl i ain't even think about that i ain't even think about that shawty you should have told me that earlier but anyway y'all um i went and did my spend 30 get five dollars off and um i got my five dollar in one cent i did another transaction and i i messed it up i effed it up y'all Thank you, Monica. Thank you so, so much. Girl, I am not the... Who is story time, baby? Y'all gonna have to... Short, short mama, you better go live, honey, because Judy says she wants some story time, honey. Short mama is the queen of story time. Short mama is the queen. Short mama, go ahead, honey, and start a, um, a live. And... Um, so you can do a story time because I'm about to go story time my fat ass in the shower, honey. And by the time I come in here and get the story time, I've been to wash my behind, honey, because my titties are sweating, my cheeks are sweating, my in between my arms is sweating, honey. The, the in between the breasts is sweating, honey. I could pour a glass of sweat, honey. Okay. 
Girl, this stockpile is not together, honey. Um, I can show y'all a little something, but I got stuff on the, the ground that I'm selling, y'all. I'm going to get up and I ain't going to be able to walk them and sitting down here so, so long. Egvita, hey, Miss Egvita, honey. I like to acknowledge y'all, all y'all. I acknowledge everybody. Ju Miss Judy, natural sweet tooth is in the house. Danielle Gibson, Denise, Tamika Bolden. Short Mama Couponer is in the house for all you people that's tuning in here. The people that has channels, honey. We have the queen of YouTube, Short Mama Couponer. She's amazing. Short Mama Couponer. We got Shorty with the receipts. Um, I think Saving with Isha left. I think Saving with Fee left. Um... But yes, if you want good deals, you need to go on over to Sharp Mama Couponer channel, honey. If you want amazing penny items, honey, Sharp it with the receipt is your queen to be. Let's see. God, Miss Denise Coda is a mess, honey. Oh, saving with Isha, she's still here, honey. All right, let me get up so I can show y'all some half of my shit because I done sold half of my stuff. Thanks to Sharp Mama Couponer. Oh, Lord Jesus. Help me up, Lord. Y'all can't see y'all. Hold on. Hold on, honey. All right, let me see y'all. Hold on. Let me see how you turn this stuff around. I can't turn this around, y'all. I don't know how to turn this camera around, y'all. I don't know. This is just a little bit, y'all. That is it, honey. I'm not, now you want to see a stockpile, y'all gonna have to go watch Sharp Mama Coupon a video, honey, because I don't have that much. I got stuff just everywhere. This is the stuff that I had did today. So, and that's just a little stuff, y'all. That's not a lot. I got stuff all on the floor. Can y'all see that? All that stuff. Y'all can't even see. Can y'all see all that? But that is all I have, honey. That is it. Y'all want to see a stockpile. Y'all have to go watch Short Mama Coupon video, honey. Because she has a stockpile. Yeah, I'm sweating, honey. I, I just, I can't take the heat, honey. Let me see, honey. Give me some of your stuff so I can add some more to it because, hold on, y'all, wait. Y'all know, how do you put together your bundles? Girl, I have to I have to ask Short Mama Coupon, honey, for help, but, like, I just put, hold on, wait, let me see. I did, <clears throat> I did this big one right here. I did the sheets right here. These people right here. I did this right here. Somebody wanted gain, so I did that. And I did this with, this is the big one for $7.50. So I'm just selling this for $25. $25 for that. Is that good enough, Sharp Mama? So that's $25, okay? This is $25. And then I did this big boy right here. So it is, let me see if I can turn around, y'all, because I can't see good. So it's this, 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 and this, and this, and this. All this, I'm doing this for $30. What you think, Short Mama? That was $30. Y'all be asking Short Mama. I be, um, I can't see. Oh, hell. Let me see, Sharp Mama. Which one you couldn't see? Do you put on a marketplace? No, I've tried that before, but that don't work out. I wish mine was that neat. You do have a neat stockpile. Uh, look at you all organized. Girl, I'm trying. I need another. I need more shelves, y'all. That's what I need. I need more shelves. But no, Sharp Mama, this one right here... It's, I did this one for 30 short mama. This one right here with this and this and this. So I did all this for $30. 
And then um, someone, and I did this one right here for 25. Then someone asked me for some shampoo, so I did four, six of these. So it's three of the conditioners and three of the shampoos. I did this for just $20, so all this for 20. Hey, Miss Loretta, you ready for the rest of the tour? So yeah, so I did this for 20, I did this for 30, and I did this one over here for uh, 25. Can y'all see that? Yep, 25. So y'all think that was good, y'all? I mean, they asked for it. <clears throat> I normally don't sell my stuff, but, um, yeah, that's what I did for little bundles and stuff, y'all. My draw is gonna be stuck to my behind, y'all. Wait, you think what? You think that's too much, Tara? Hey, the teacher, AZ. Y'all, my clothes gonna be stuck to my body. I'm full of sweat, honey. 25 seems very reasonable to a family in need. Don't feel bad about it. Gain 50 bucks. Oh, you want me to sell a game for $50? <laughs> Wait. I think $50, that's too much. But I need a closer picture. Okay, short mama. Let me let me get this for short mama, y'all. Hold on. That's that's my queen right there. Hold on. Okay. So this is the one for 30, short mama. This is the big one right here. This is the big one for $13.50. This is the dishwashing liquid. <clears throat> this is the little game for $5. And this is the one for $3. And this is the one for $4.50. Um, and then this is the one for $4.95 and $4.95. So I did that for $30. Um, so what what but what I did was I take I took the original prices y'all and I added up all the original prices. I think with that it's the original price, it's um the taxes, it's the it's just the getting out going about and doing it too. So like for the one that I'm selling for thirty dollars, the total came up to like thirty seven dollars. The original I mean the original price with everything. If I do, they want the one fifty ounce I just so one you need to email me i will help you uh light oh thank you danielle i like the video everyone please and thank you thank you alexander b y'all the teacher az is in the house welcome to this live thank you monica i love you monica um t graham 50 you think danielle you think i should charge 50 dollars for that game Girl, I feel bad. I feel like I'm ripping somebody off. Okay, 30 is good because your taxes are high. Okay, thank you, Sean Mama. Um, Sean Mama, are you gonna go live and do a story time, honey? Because if I the way I'm feeling right now, and if I do a story time, mine's gonna be X-rated. I'm sorry. I'm sweet, I'm kind, I don't like negativity, but if I do. If I do a story time, it is not going to be, um, it's going to be X-rated, honey, okay? That's the story time for me. It's going to be X-rated. I'm ready for short time. Y'all better, short mama, you better get on for because if I start a conversation, it's going to be X-rated, okay? Girl, I look a hot mess too. I'm, I'm sweating and my drawers sticking to my behind, my bra sticking to my behind. I'm going to have to go take a shower, honey. I'm tired. I should have bought me a, a bottle of wine. I need a glass of wine. Because me and Essence went to eat at her favorite place, La Coretta, honey. And, um, wait, okay. Come on, Short Mama, so we can. Yeah, Short Mama gonna have to go live. Because if I go live, it's, it's my topic of story time is going to be X-rated. So, y'all may want Short Mama to go live. Because if I go live, honey, we gonna talk about some stuff. Okay? So... <laughs> I'm telling y'all, y'all don't know me from behind the camera, honey, okay? Because behind the camera, I'm a totally different person, okay? And um, I started keep on it with you, short mama, short for life. That's right, honey. We were short mama for life. Short mama, they want a story time, honey. You know we coming. You know we coming. Okay, it's either y'all go, it's either short mama, I want both. Oh, really, Denise? You, you want to go X-rated? 
Honey, did you ever do that other life? No, I didn't. Okay, so let me tell you something. Y'all want to talk, we can talk. But I'm not talking about no damn coupon and if I talk. I will come tomorrow. I'm not talking about no coupon and if y'all want story time. I'm not talking about no no um store items. I'm not talking about it, okay? Y'all want a story time? It's not going to be about no damn coupon, okay? Because I'm getting sleepy. Okay, so y'all want to talk, okay? I have 37 people up in here. If you do not want to talk, you may want to log off. So 36 is here. 37 was and 36 is go, okay? I think of you every time it is the off time. Oh, yeah, y'all. No sure mama favorite saying. You straight fool, girl. No damn coupon. I'm not talking about no damn coupons. If I'm going, if y'all want it, if y'all want a topic, I need y'all to thumbs up, honey. If y'all, <laughs> if y'all want to do story time with me, honey, I'm telling y'all, it's not about to be, uh, it's about to be X-rated, okay? Miss Barbara. <laughs> Okay, how many people want it, honey? Cause when we talk about it, y'all gonna have to y'all have to tune chime on in because you can't be shy. You can't be shy, okay? All right, so let's talk. Okay, have you ever? Okay, let me ask you this. Okay, do you think? Hey, Tara. <laughs> okay, all right, y'all ready? Let's go. Let's see. So when we talk, when I ask this, okay, we we have no judgmental people in the room. We have no negative. We not throwing no stones at nobody. Okay, we not judging nobody. Okay. My question is: Do you think y'all listening? Do you think a man is gay if he want you to mess with his backyard? Answer the question. Do you think that person is gay? Do you think that person has been with a man before? If that man asks you to mess with his backyard, do you think this man is gay? Do you think he's bisexual? Do you think he's a freak? What do you think? If this person like his backyard licked, if he like it fingered, if he um, wants you to lick his butthole, do you think this person is gay? A lot of people are saying yes. Okay, I've asked this question before. Okay, so I'm T say bye. Okay, so what if you think he messed with a man before? If he want someone to mess with his backyard? I told y'all, this is X-rated. I'm this. This is story time for me. I have to finish my grade and keep the much love. Oh, Monica, love you. Don't forget to send me your stuff. He may be bisexual. Okay, hell to the yeah, run. <laughs> with a guy, or he's thinking about messing with the guy. He's bisexual. Okay, so he did jail time. So I, I, I've heard some men say. He has a want to mess with a man. Okay. I've heard some people say that you just met each or been to, you just met each or been together. Wait, what, Miss Chilton? No, some men just like the feeling licking, but no sticking. Okay. Okay. So you say licking, Monica. What if that person like you to stick something in their butthole? And he's a male and he so claimed that he's not gay. He says he's not gay. He just wanted. Want his butthole tickled. Wheelchair and all. <laughs> Monica say bi or gay. No, the person is supposed to be straight. The person supposedly don't like men. The person supposedly hadn't been with a man. Um, it has been known that men get an orgasm from their backyard. But... To me, I, I don't feel like a man should want a woman to to do that. That's just me, okay? Okay. So with me, I'm not I'm not I, I love my gay people, I do, and I respect a lot of gay men that is able to say I'm gay. I have so much respect for them and I've met so many men and if I I've asked so many questions 
um to them in regards to if a man is gay or you know and most of them would tell me um most of them would say that he's no that's no straight anything he's low down and on the down i i agree with you danielle i agree with danielle i agree with danielle and some of the the men that i spoke to that is gay they said that yes that person is gay um and that person have or been with a man before and um he said you know most of the men that with women and ask women to do that that they either been with a man or um and i guess i'm saying this because a man can hate a woman so much a man can can constantly mess over women so much and they can hate women because they actually want to be with a man and i think it's wrong for a man to constantly cheat on a woman repeatedly over and over and over again and you're only doing it because you're not happy within yourself and you're not where you want to be and i think this was happening with a lot of men today um a lot of marriages a lot of relationships are failing because these men really want to be with a man so they choose to hurt women and um I don't know. I just think it's not right. So, I've, yes, abusive relationships. Yes, toxic relationships. Um, Y'all know I dealt with so much. Y'all know I was in a very, very toxic relationship. And, um, and I think that was one of the problems with this person. I think this person um, hated women so much and hated to be with me as a woman because I am not what you really, really wanted to be with. So you chose to hurt me as a woman because you really wanted to be with a man. So you wanted to do all those things that a man that you wanted, you wanted me to do all those things that you really wanted a man to do. They say you are what you eat. So why would he want someone to eat that butt? <laughs> Wait, girl. <laughs> okay, so you know people eating ass now, okay? That is the thing now. A lot of people are doing that now. Yes, a lot of people are licking the butthole. I don't know. I've had mine licked before, okay? Yes, I have. Someone has done it to me, okay? A lot of people in relationships is doing that. A lot of people is doing that, y'all. Y'all know your, what is Nicki Minaj? They eat the booty like grocery. Yes, they are eating it like cereal. <laughs> I don't know if that's the new thing, y'all. <laughs> Shut <Sure>, mama. <laughs> Shut sure, mama say doo doo. Y'all, I'm telling you, this is the new thing. A lot of men are doing that to women these days. And a lot of women are doing it to women. I mean... <laughs> sure mama say doo doo that's nasty one paper cup for everyone now <laughs> i'm okay i guess it depends on the individual because i guess if if you you're uh, it's it's a lot to it y'all it's it's a lot to it it's some really really freaks out here um can't please a man sexually Yes, Danielle, they say you are what, yeah, I got that one, abusive relationships, I totally agree. I, um, if they were with a man before, yes, he's probably gay, he may be in the closet or scared to admit it. Yes, Denise, um, have you just met each other or have you been with each other for a long time? Because that has a lot to deal with it, he could be just a freak or maybe, oh shit, or maybe he's just for his serious. I don't know. I don't know. I I can't. I don't know. Ain't ain't tossing no salad over here. They can have all it. Okay, they got some freaks now. They they eating it now. What happened to just licking the pearl? Now people doing the most. Yes, people are now doing all type of different sexual activities y'all um i've always wanted to know the answer to the question so i feel like asking not a man man i feel like asking a man that is gay that question you would get the answer um because 
I think so many men, and I'm just being honest, I think so many men is into uh, wanting to be with a man. I also feel like if a man want to enter your your backyard, I this is my opinion. I feel like if a man want to enter a woman's backyard, I feel like you want to know what it feel like and I just feel like that's something for two gay men to do. Not um you constantly going into your old lady backyard. That's just me. So, I mean, everybody may not think or think in the way that I think. But, um, yes, I'm a freak, okay? Um, but it's certain things that I'm not going to engage in. But if you want to ask for certain things, certain ways, it has a question mark in my head. You can be so sexually attracted to someone that you would do anything with that person. And I'm just keeping it real. Um, when you're sexually attracted to someone you would do anything and sometimes when you're so deeply in love with someone you would do anything now i've done some stuff but i've never ever ever honey been with a woman that's just me i'm not i can't i want i don't have nothing against it i'm just not you know i'm just not going to do that Okay, because I got to go wash that girl now, okay? Because she's getting kind of sweaty, honey. But I'm not going to do that, okay? But I love I love to sit down and I love to have a conversation with them, y'all. I enjoy, especially the guys, y'all. Um, I've met so many of them, y'all. We exchange phone numbers. And I ask questions, y'all. And they be like, well, damn. And I would be like, well, I want to know. Who doing who? What you doing? What you like? And there's so many different conversations that we have y'all and it's like it's interesting it, it's very interesting interesting or whatever and uh <laughs> i ask questions y'all i ask questions you know do you use ky do it hurt do you like it what you do i've had one guy you know he really looked at more feminine and he was like no he's not the taker he's the giver i said oh okay all right yeah okay but yes i ask questions y'all um any other topics that you guys want to talk about honey because i told y'all my story time is not going to be about no damn coupon and honey i'm sorry honey i need short more i'm gonna go live so she can make y'all laugh because some gay men are some of the lowest girl yes t i met some of them in um in Texas Row House, y'all, I met a total of four of them. And it, the conversations was interesting. And um, it's, it's so many questions I always have and I just ask. And that was one of the questions I asked. If a man wants you to fiddle his backyard, is he gay? You know, and, and I don't know. You could be a freak, don't get me wrong. But I feel like if you want to have a woman... Uh, finger you in your butthole or put a vibrator in your butthole or lick or blow in your butthole i think that you want a man in your ass or you um have had that before yeah that's just me okay um but that's it y'all i'm about to wrap it up honey if before i log off if y'all have any other questions or want to talk about anything else now is the time because the water is calling me the water is calling for me i'm tired y'all i'm sitting on the ground i am not baby i am not gonna be able to get my fat ass up honey so i'm gonna need somebody to come and help me up <laughs> um we thought sally was coming our way y'all but sally has turned and did something honey we got so many hurricanes in the gulf i'm not touching no man's body <laughs> it's done over we ain't talking <laughs> love your story time honey thank you monica you're cautious because of your life experience and and it's a good way to be okay so alexander b stop calling girl i am sure mom okay so it's a few people in here know what i've been through and know what happened um you know um with me and my my past relationship um it was a six year toxic 
relationship to where I am not even interested in dating right now because of of what he did and what he put me through. Um, yeah, it was trauma. He stole from me. He stole my. He stole out of my coupon and stockpile. Um, shop mama know about it. He um, all the bills that he paid. He went called all the. He went called his his bank and he had it all. Um, he did it as a. He did it saying that it was unauthorized payments. So um, that all came back to me and I had to pay and still paying hundreds of dollars uh, on bills. Um, but um, I'm doing fine. I'm doing much better now. Much better, honey, because it's been a long time. Um, yeah, Miss Pauline. Hey, honey, he did. And um, it said that I know I, I girl and you know what, short mama, I probably have to text you because. You know, God don't sleep, you know, and um, you can't, you know, do somebody wrong and expect God to constantly bless you. Um, so, I mean, the bills that he did ran up, um, like my water bill, my light bill, um, just, I mean, I just thank God that I was able to get through it. And um, a lot of my um, supporters was there. Short Mama was definitely there. Um, it was, it was tragic, y'all. Um, it really was. <laughs> but we what? it was January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August. It's been nine months. It's been nine months. And, um, I've talked to guys, don't get me wrong, but I'm not, I'm just not there because I don't have time for, I don't have, I'm not going to say I don't have time. I'm not going to deal with the lies. I'm not going to deal with the ma manipulation. I'm not going to let you love me in private and not in public. It's just a not that I'm not going to deal with. You're not coming to my home. Um, it's just a lot. So many men that I find today is married and they want to have someone else on the side. No, we're not going to do that. It's just so much, y'all, and, and what that person put me through, and I just, it's, it's crazy. Um, if you checked my community tab, like, months back, y'all, I took a picture of him stealing my stuff. I took a picture of the truck parked there and him stealing my stuff. Um, and that day that my stuff was stolen, I just came home because I was in the process of moving anyway, so he don't even know where I moved to. Um, but yeah, um, I was in the process of moving and I had to go meet someone to, uh, to switch my, my cable over. I remember you made a whole video. Yes, I did. I made a whole video. Miss Barbara was there too. Yeah. It's hard for me to trust. Um, girl, you need to, you need me to come back. <laughs> um, yeah, the TJZ, thank you. I'm out. It's y'all. I'm so much better now, y'all. I am so much better. Y'all have no clue. You so much better. I thought you was going to lose yourself. I'm so happy for you. Yes, I I did lose it. I did. It, it got that bad. It did. I guess it's because you give your all. I'm a good person, first of all. You give your all. You do your all. You do so much. You give so much, and then you, no matter what you do, how much you do, how much you give, the person still just cheats. And it's like, well, damn. If you getting all this treatment, why you feel you have to go? Just look for more hoes. I mean, I should, probably shouldn't have said that, but <laughs> I mean, you just get sick of it, you know. Yes, yes, Monica. It's since been since January. It's been since January. Um, um, I've I've had the heartache, I've had the pain, but I also had the blessings. I have good people in my corner. I end up getting a new vehicle. Um, a lot of good stuff was happening to me. You have a pure heart, honey. Yes, I I do. I will help. It's just y'all just don't know what I did. You know, and and how I was there, and just to be kicked in the ass like that, it, it just it's like unbelievable. It, well, it was unbelievable. And then last month was it last month? A chick called my phone, actually looking for this person, 
and i wasn't trying to be mean i wasn't trying to be rude but the things that i told her do not call my damn phone looking for no man and um that just went to show me that even after all this has happened you still doing the same thing so not only did you get two baby not only did you get one baby on me you end up having another baby so yeah i just had to tell that little girl don't call my phone looking for no man or whatever you know and um yeah so i'm over that i'm still getting over it i'm not gonna say i'm completely over it but i'm still getting over it but i'm to the point now to where like i just don't have time for the lies and the cheating like i just don't have time for it so like you can kick rocks and some people or some guys will like oh my god like um you know you a bitch or whatever no i'm it's not that um it's not that i'm a you know a b or whatever like that it's just I'm not dealing with it. Like, now I could just read through a man and be like, you not. Oh, I'm fucking so dramatic. I remember her in the freezer at CVS. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah, y'all. Yeah, um, yeah, it's been a journey for me. It, it's been a journey for me. And then all that happened. Then I lost my sister um, on Easter Sunday. I lost my sister. Um she was very sick so i lost her so in the midst of all that um lord that brought tears to my eyes so in the midst of me going through what he did i lost my sister um yeah it it was 2020 was is the beginning of 2020 was rough for me y'all and and i'm still dealing with it but um i'm okay now we supposed to be talking about something else we wasn't supposed to be talking about all this y'all i wasn't supposed to be getting teary-eyed now um Time is right and unexpected. Right when we'll come. Yeah, Miss Erica, you right about that, girl. It's just I'm to the point to where I don't even give a damn. Give me a give me a good point, honey, and my hand, and I'm gonna be just fine, okay? And that's how we gonna do that, okay? I'm gonna keep my own self <laughs> exploding, okay? If you know what I mean. Kanisha, I've been there before about seven years ago. This man was a yes, that's exactly what he was, Kanisha. He was a narcissist, honey. He was a narcissist. And a narcissist can make you feel like like you are the bad person. A narcissist can make you feel like you just not good enough. A narcissist will take everything from you, honey. It will drain you. And that's what he did. He drained me. And I am slowly climbing up the ladder. I am slowly climbing up the ladder to get myself back straight. And I'm still doing it. But I'm doing it. I am doing it. But he is, he was, and he is a narcissist. And and it's, it's crazy. But guess what? I don't wish bad on nobody, uh, Kanisha. I really don't. But guess what? The plant that person was working in, the plant has closed down. The... I could say so much, but I'm not. I'm not. I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to do it. I, it's whatever. It's done. It's over. And um, like my mama always say, you shall reap what you sow. And I think that person is sowing. And and God don't sleep. And, and God don't want nothing bad to happen to his children. You know, but God will lead you in the right path. But it's up to you to take that left. And um, the devil will intervene. So if you let the devil intervene, then, you know, that's that's on you but he was a narcissist um and he put stuff in my name yes and lied about everything so i have trust issues too but i met someone and he's a blessing well girl i don't know where he at honey but wherever he at i'm waiting on him too honey i'm waiting on him too but i've talked to guys and i've cut them off quick because i don't have time for it so many narcissists yes alexander yes the teacher az Pluck that purr and keep it going. That's what I do. I pluck her, honey. I pluck her, honey. Yes, I do, honey. My two fingers, and that's it. I don't like vibrators. I don't like deal doors, honey. I don't like them people. Uh, I like to watch porn, honey. And I will use my fingers, and I will roll away, honey. Roll away. Do you hear me? That is me, honey. Yes, Miss Barbara. The fellow coupon is in preppers <laughs> navy girl um wait is this woman's talk or what hey mr lewis mr lewis you was in wait mr lewis was in my last when we had started talking about 
um uh, mr lewis the man that um is is he gay if he like it in his backyard or like to be tickled by a woman i can't see <laughs> roll those ecbs and <laughs> yep that's them honey that's who my girl is in love with honey love don't live here no more yeah, I might gonna have to handle it to teach AZ tonight when I get out the shower, honey. Yes. <laughs> love do not live here no more, honey. I don't even know y'all to even think I can love again, y'all. I don't know. It's gonna take it's gonna take a different kind of love to win my heart, y'all. I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. It's gonna be I don't want don't even give me your credit card. I don't want no credit cards no more. I want straight cash. Because credit cards will damage you as he did to me. But, uh, yes, I need cash. No credit cards, honey. Um, okay, Mr. Lewis. I don't know what it's going to take. But, you know, um, that 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 relationship, my last relationship was just, it was just heartbreaking. And just, it was awful. Um, yeah, but, like, um, the TJC, most, like... I've tried Tinder, um, and trying Tinder is like, these dudes, man, thank you, Miss Johnson, thank you, T, these dudes on Tinder, y'all, like, some of them I've talked to, some of them I felt like one guy told me um, uh, that we would have to, he said we, we could meet, that's what he said, y'all, but let me tell you what he did, and this was a red flag for me, he said, Oh, um, my sister and my niece lives with me or whatever. And he was like, can I come over with you? No, you're not coming by me because my daughter lives with me. We could meet out and about, but we never would meet. So that was a red flag for me because I felt like the sister that you were talking about and the niece that you were talking about, I felt like that was your wife and your daughter. That was a red flag for me. Um... Then it has another, other guys, most of the guys on there is married, y'all, on Tinder. So, I don't think all of them are, but most of them are. And I just, I'm drained. I'm drained. I am drained. I'm not, I took it, um, short mama, I'm not on it anymore. I got off. Um, the, so red flags for me is a lot now, y'all. I pay attention to a lot of stuff now. If your phone is on silence and if your phone is on vibrate, that's a problem for me. If you cannot answer your phone when I'm with you, that's a problem for me. If we cannot meet out and about in public, that's a problem for me. Um, if I can't meet your friends, that's a problem for me. I'm 41 years old, y'all, and I don't have time for the BS. I don't. And um, if you have kids and if you're not spending time with your kids, that's a problem for me. Because if you can't love your kids, you cannot love me. It's, it's so many, it's so many red flags. And in my last relationship, it was so many red flags that I ignored. And instead of ignoring the red flags, um, I could have been out of the relationship a long time ago a long time ago um and it's just so much and i feel like if you're talking to someone be straight up and ask them and or tell them what you want because it just saves a lot of damn time um it just thank you alexander b it just saves a lot of time if you be straight up now i feel like if you if, if you come up to me or whatever okay a lot of men are infatuated with my lips, y'all. I don't know why, but a lot of men love my lips, y'all. If you just want to be an F buddy, you need to be straight up. Let me make that decision to say, no, I'm good or whatever. If you just want to be friends, just say you want to be friends. You know, but if you married or you already in a relationship, you trying to find you a side chick, nobody got time for that. Nobody don't have time for that. And I'm too old and... It's getting to the point where I may just end up by myself, honey. And my daughter always be like, Mama, no, you're not. But you know, can I give you? Yes, you can, Mr. Lewis. Yes, that's why y'all are here, honey. Everybody wanted a story time, honey. So, yes, a man can give the most valuable information when it comes to another man. And um, they say 
you have to stop looking for what you want and try something different something that you wouldn't want that would treat you like you should be treated that's what i've heard okay so it's like sometimes you attract it's what you attract so it's like instead of me being attracted to a certain type of man that i like i need to stop that um i have zero tolerance for foolishness i love myself too much and i know my worth i wish i knew this monica 15 years ago i could have saved myself you're right monica and i think that goes for myself also it, it's it's the truth and the thing is we ignore a lot of stuff as women thinking that it can make a man love us more and it's not right and i feel like if we see these flags we need to address the flags and if the flags is not getting addressed it's okay to let it go and after my hurt and pain that i had in this relationship i let it go i mean i'm at peace now and i don't want you to disturb my peace and by me being at peace i can cut you off real quick now because i'm not about to let you disturb my peace um just go out your business and someone will be who you need that's right the teacher az navy gray no don't make no moves tinder or any dating sites like i heal you yeah and you right danielle um alexander be married with children they want only booty calls you right denise and i don't have time for it and they had a guy um they had a guy um he was very sweet and i had to like stop him in his tracks i'm like what is your intentions or whatever very nice guy um and um he said that he wasn't looking for a relationship but the thing is and i'm not trying to put nobody on blast but you sent me a picture of your body part which was covered right and then you're gonna tell me that you were horny so now i'm about to stop you in your tracks because first of all if you just want to be friends right and um you don't want anything further but you want to do booty no we're not going to do that okay if you don't want more than um a relationship then you're not getting a booty we're not doing that okay we're just not going to do that okay so what we're going to do is we're going to cut this off okay you can forget my number okay let me read mr lewis the problem is women look for the man but the truth is the man's supposed to find the woman and you're right about that you're right few men are looking for love most are looking for help so by you saying most looking for help mr lewis do you mean most looking for help such as in a good way or help in a bad way like yeah sure mama like i don't know what it, i don't know if i got just f me written all over me or i just want to be f written all over me i don't know what it is i don't know i have no clue um really where is the story on that right true i engaged to a man that is the complete opposite of my type and short mama i think that's what i think i think that's what i need to deal with someone that um you know someone that is that i'm not like i don't know shall i say attracted to because i, I don't know I, I have to have some type of attraction to to a man like i can't just date somebody and i don't have an attraction to that person um bad way we seek weak women we take advantage of. and you know what mr lewis um you're right you're right and um i feel like i don't know if i'm gonna say weak but i feel like me for myself i'm a giving loving person and i do think that men take advantage of that i, I really do um and you're right about that you you're so right but i think now i know how to stop that man in his tracks if that makes sense to you i know what i'm not going to i know what i'm not going to accept and i know what i'm not going to deal with so if i feel like you or um just wanting one thing i'm gonna cut you off if i feel like you want to be in private i'm gonna cut you off it's just little what you allow because you right mr lewis is so right lewis is right it's not just you keep the scene men or like that yeah we can receive this gift and the gift is someone else spend a blessing when i started living myself and was at peace of being with myself god sent me what wanted and i'm ha i'm so happy for you kanisha he acting like you're jump oh yes honey i wanted a man like steve 
I love how he just loved Laura when I was a teenager. Shit, uh, my daddy, I was going to marry me a man like Steve Urkel. We have to practice and address issues. If he won't answer them, then next. You right. The problem is when, okay, I had read that part. Um, but you're smarter now. You allow what puts in you. As they say, when you know better, you do better. Yes, that's right. That I mean, it's right, y'all. And um, right now, I'm to the point where I'm really not interested in dating. I'm just not. The world is changing. Men used to take advantage of women. Now we want to be taken care of. And um, yeah, girl, the sweat is real, Navy. It's sweating the boobs, sweating the cat, sweating the ass. Everything is sweating. Under arm is sweating. In between the crack of my arms is sweating, honey. Girl, I, I might have to just sit in the tub and just let the water just pour down on me, honey. Yes. Um, this came after me. He kept trying, you know. Told him I'm not ready for marriage. But he said he's willing to wait because you got you a good one, short mama. For the sweet man. Um, so I'm, I'm to the point where I'm really not interested in, in dating and... Um, what a lot of young guys is coming for me y'all a lot of young guys like i'm 41 years old and most of the guys that are coming for me are like in their 20s and i'm like y'all are just babies like i'm 41 years old like i'm decades older than you guys but a lot of young guys seems like they are looking for a mother exactly a lot of young guys are interested in me and then when i say i'm too old for you you know what they say Age ain't nothing but a number, but I mean, I just you're just too young. Serious mama issues, so he had a real hatred for women, strong women, and try sometimes succeed. He's in the jail for murder. You're right, Monica, and um, yes, he prayed. He he prayed on me. He had his good things about him, but he drained me. He drained me. Um, he took advantage. Um, he he messed up my my credit, my bill. It, it was a lot. It's just a lot. Um, girl, you put that good thing on him. <laughs> Navy girl, I thought I tried that too. Shit, they ain't work for me. Yeah, be patient and the right man will come. I'm, I'm, I am short mama. I promise you, I have gotten to that point, short mama, to where now I'm not even worried about it. I'm not too young. I'm not in the business to teach right now. And T Graham, I'm trying to tell you, honey. I am trying to tell you. I have to keep telling these little boys. Look. My daughter just made 20, honey. My daughter just made 20. You too young for me. You too young. I'm going to be on a cane. Would you be pushing me in a wheelchair? No, we're not going to do that. Short mama, most women don't want to wait. They want it now. I'm going to wait, Mr. Lewis. I'm I'm good. I'm good right now. Um, I'm good right now, honey, because this thing, and I know young boy can't handle this whippersnapper, honey. I'm sorry. And I'm not about to have no little young boy crying behind me, honey. And he too young. I'm not messing with no 20 year olds, honey. What the song is, don't mess with my juvie. He got to and he know how to use it. We not going to do that, okay? So, I don't want no young bucks. I want an older, younger, an older man because their upbringings taught them how to. Now, you know, I've had some older ones, too, that's still not grown up. I've had some older ones come for me, too, and um, and they still playing games, too. They have the older ones still playing games, too. Then you got to deal with his mama. Girl, I'm not, look, it's the young guys dealing with his mama, honey. Then him saying, you too old for my son. Okay, I'm not disrespecting nobody, mama, but I'm about to go. That'll be me. I can tell you how to play my games, but it can be dangerous. <laughs> Short mama, girl, I don't know, honey. Some of them are immature as well. Yeah, girl, I can't deal with no 27-year-old boy and I go home to your mama. Your mama like, how old are you? I'm 41 years old and you in your 20s, honey. Because if I had a young son that was 20 and he bought a 40-something 41 year old woman home i'm gonna be like what the hell is you doing with my son honey like you're too old hey taryn you're too old to turn my be with my son honey we're not gonna do that um but yeah y'all i'm about to get my fat ass off of this ground <laughs> i'm sleeping that be like you 
dating. Yes, it's like statutory rape. I feel like R. Kelly and Aaliyah, honey. No, we're not going to do that. We're not, we not going to do that, y'all. But I have work in the morning, y'all. It is 10.34, y'all. I've been on here for 74 a minute, an hour, almost two hours. Short mama, are you going live, honey? Huh, I'm talking about she looking a mess, honey. And she thicker than a snicker. She done got her waistline, honey. She ain't got no stomach, honey. I need to go buy me a trainer, y'all. Why not, girl? You know people be looking for your story times. Oh, it's 1034 here, Miss Barbara. So, uh, did y'all uh, well, did y'all all request for y'all $5, okay? I'm about to go sit there before I go to bed. Short mama put a hot on and go live. She needs to go live. Y'all, you know y'all, she done uh, slimmed up on us, honey. She done slimmed up on us, honey. She done slimmed up, honey. And y'all know Thanksgiving coming, honey. Baby, did y'all watch? <laughs> did y'all watch your girl? Honestly, as a woman, we ignore truth when it is in our face, when they show us who they are, they need to believe. You right, Shelly. We waiting on a storm. No sleep tonight. Oh, my cowboy's in the house, honey. My cowboy's in the house, Tennessee Couponer, honey. Tennessee Couponer. 11.35. Oh, Lord. Oh, Tennessee Couponer. You missed it, honey. Tennessee Couponer, you missed it. Tennessee Couponer was on my last live, y'all, when we was talking about the men that like they butthole tickled honey. He was on my my live, my last live when we did that. Uh Tennessee Couponer has a channel, y'all. Um, I have 37 of you guys tuned in. Thank you for the 37 likes. I appreciate you guys. Um, y'all get over. All y'all do is click on his name, um, Tennessee Couponer, click on his name and subscribe to his channel. I love him. I love his accent. I love his personality. Um, he's the bomb to me. He's my bae. <laughs> he's my bae, honey. Him and Mr. Beach Walker and Mr. Alexander B, honey. Pray for us. We're in the path of one. Where are you, Danielle? Of these storms tonight. Are you in Florida, Danielle? Greeting, short mama. Miss Joycelyn, you been in here, girl? I appreciate you too, my cowboy. Mwah. Uh, Danielle, where are you? Are you in Florida? You sure, mama? I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you, honey. Tennessee Couponer, sure, mama. Couponer said you have the sexiest voice. <laughs> oh, Danielle, you in Alabama? Um, is it raining? Are you okay? Are y'all safe? Tennessee Couponer, you know we love you, honey. Miss Jocelyn, yes, honey. Thank you, Miss Jocelyn. Y'all, I'm not going to be able to get off this floor, honey. Y'all, thank you, Tennessee Couponer. Well, Danielle, I'll be praying for you guys that everything is okay with y'all. Um, it was heading for us in Louisiana. Thank you, Miss Taylor. Um, well, you be safe. Oh, y'all, Miss um, Tara. Miss Tara has a channel, too. Um, y'all, y'all already know Short Mama Couponer does. I think Charlotte with the receipts going to sleep, honey. So, we have, I think, Saving with Isha is probably still in here, too. Saving with Isha, Short Mama Couponer, Tennessee Couponer is TN Couponer, Tennessee Couponer. And, um, who am I missing? Who am I missing? Who am I missing? The teacher AZ, who am I missing? Somebody was just clicked in here. Um, they all have channels, y'all. All you have to do is click on uh, the Tara. Tara has a channel, Miss Tara YouTube. Y'all, all you do is click on their name and it'll take you straight to their channel and you subscribe and you ring that bell, honey. Ring the bell. <clears throat> y'all, I gotta get off of here because I'm tired, honey. I'm tired, honey. I got an eye right here. I got two eyes over here. I feel like a teenager going through puberty, honey. These masks is breaking me the hell out. Um, 
And I gotta make my money up, y'all. I have a I have a fish. I'm gonna put my fish in the community tab, y'all. I have a new fish. My fish name is Nelly, honey, like the rapper. <laughs> I'm gonna put it in the community tab so y'all can see it, y'all. All right. Um, I went and did the game. I have three accounts. I did it on two accounts, y'all, and I got my five dollars. And I did another deal. Um, and I messed up on the other one, y'all, because I only got my subtotal to, uh, girl, Coda is in there cutting up. I got my subtotal to 12. Yes, y'all, my fish name is Nelly. Nelly. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna show y'all. I'm about to get up right now. I'm about to get up and I'm gonna close off. I'm gonna show y'all Coda, y'all. Hold on. Ooh, child. Ooh. Ooh, y'all, I'm sore. Ooh, y'all, I feel like an old woman. Hold on. Let's see. Can't put Essence on camera, y'all, because she going to say something crazy. They wanted to see Coda. Come on, let's go show them the fish, Coda. <laughs> Essence doing homework, y'all. She's studying. That's Coda, y'all. Let me show y'all. Oh, that's his new bed, y'all. He didn't agree. We can't put him in the water until tomorrow, y'all, because we had to put some stuff in there. So we had to put this stuff in there today but honestly i think you're better off i mean we're both and we put this stuff in there tomorrow so i have a fish now y'all <laughs> yes how did you know denise nelly is a better beta what you call it new better beta yeah look it's this Twin hell moon half moon beta. You absolutely right, girl. That's my new fish. So she can't go in the tank till tomorrow. And that's Cody, y'all. <laughs> girl, yeah, we named it. We named I named it before I got it. I named it Nelly. <laughs> Y'all, that's S and she's studying, y'all. Coda, you want to speak? You want to say hey, Coda? Huh? You want to say hey? Get down. Hey, get down. Get your butt down. Y'all, that's Coda, honey. That is Coda, honey. And that is our new pet. <laughs> that's our new pet, y'all. All right, yeah, I'm about to log off, y'all. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. Thank you guys for tuning in, honey. And now I'm about to go send money, honey. Good night, short mama coupon. I appreciate you guys. I love all of y'all. I love all of y'all. Thank you guys for the support. I appreciate you all, honey. Coda tired, y'all. He tired. He worn out, y'all. All right, your girl is out. All right, T. Graham. I love you all.